This is Coco Chanel. Chanel is the designer and owner of Chanel Fashion, a famous designer brand. Chanel's mom, Janine de Vaux, gave birth to her on August 19, 1883. Born Gabrielle Chanel, the nickname Coco was given to her while singing and dancing for the so soldiers during the war. Even though Chanel became rich and famous, she did not grow up that way. After the abandonment of her father, Henry Albert Chanel, and the death of her mother, Chanel spent years in custody of the Sisters of the Sacred Heart. The Sisters of the Sacred Heart is an orphanage run by nuns. It was here in their custody that Chanel was able to learn how to embroider, iron, and sew. Chanel had always been an independent woman who never gave people special treatment. Chanel actually refused to give anything to the royal family for free. She once said, These princesses and duchesses, they never pay their bills. Why should I give them something for nothing? No one ever gave me anything. In 1913, with a little help from her male admirers, she got to open her first shop in Paris. In 1919, once her hat business and her new store had earned some fame and money, she was able to afford to grow her designs to more than just hats. In the 1920s, Chanel introduced the little black dress to the world. Chanel's intention for the little black dress was to give women something comfortable and easy to wear. Many magazines and articles predicted that it would be worn around the, years for, around the world for years to come. Then, in 1921, Coco Chanel created her first perfume. Her perfume was called Chanel No. 5 because Chanel was told by a fortune teller that 5 was her lucky number. This perfume was also the first perfume ever to be named after the designer. In 1939, when Coco Chanel was 56 years old, she had to close her business because of World War II. There were some papers that were released that suggested Chanel was a denunciation agent, but most people think it's true, but some disagree and say that that's not fair. People think that she was just trying to keep her business alive for as long as she could. In 1954, when Chanel was 71 years old, even though she had more than enough money to retire, she reopened her business. The reason she reopened her business was because she told the actress Marlene Dietrich that she was dying of boredom. Coco Chanel died January 10th in 1971, when she was 87 years old. Chanel went out on a walk with her dear friend Cla Claude Berlin, then went back to her, to her hotel room in the Ritz Hotel. Coco Chanel died of a heart attack while she was laying on her bed. Her last words were to her roommate, and she said, You see, this is how you die. After Con Coco Chanel died, she gave her famous designer company to Eileen and Grenard who took over as co-owners of the Chanel brand in 1974. Currently, the Westminster family owns the famous brand. I chose Coco Chanel because she made history with women's clothes and freed women from tight corsets and uncomfortable dresses. Even though Chanel went through some tough times, she still pushed through and worked hard.